welcome to Vlogmas Day 47. Today is a travel day. These are always the days that get a little sticky with vlogging because I'm like rushed and stressed. So I don't think to pick up my camera and also I'm just traveling so not a lot of interesting things are happening. But we will prevail. Gosh darn it, we will prevail because we're not skipping a day. We're not skipping a day. Um, hi. Welcome to, hi, I'm Rich Ballinger, and today I am flying to the East Coast to visit my girlfriend's family for a few days for Christmas. Um, and then she, Abby's gonna stay out there, and I'm gonna fly back on the 20th so I can be with my family for Christmas. But I have a lot to do, and two and a half hours to do it in, so. I'm already feeding the dogs. I started a load of laundry. I need to walk them. Joy, don't get mad at me. I know that should be reversed. I should walk them and then feed them. I'm gonna live my life right now. <laughs> Joy is one of my best friends and also my dog trainer. <laughs> Whoops. Anyway, I need to run to the bank. I need to film something for Tuesday's video and shower and pack. Yeah, I can do it all. Don't worry about it. Just don't even stop stressing. All right, I'm on my way to the bank. Blaze is with me. Enrichment! My tax guy said I have to deposit a check today to myself. I have to pay myself. It's weird. Um, so anyway, I have to go do that before I leave. And on the 20th, I have to do it again. It's weird having running your own business, but being it, it's it's you, but it's a business. So you have to pay your, it's bizarre. I just do what he says. Okay, Blaze, how you doing? Tell us about your morning. That's good. Where am I? Why isn't the window open? Why is it so cold? Okay, where's my blankie? Mama M, Miss Joy. Gee, are we there? Where are we going? I spent all morning getting ready and we left exactly on time at 10. And I decided to fly out of the Santa Barbara airport because I am over LAX. So we drove all the way to Santa Barbara and my mom's driving yeah. us. Say hi, mom. Hi. Um, don't crash, please. Neutral. Okay. Try okay. I, my, I, I have a thing. I don't like when my parents drive me around. Well, I'm not in my car. Oh, I'm yeah. I'm in dad's car. You're doing great. I'm very appreciative of this. Oh, Nevin's fence is just destroyed. Is that on purpose? Maybe she likes it that way. Okay, well, that's fine. Um, on the way to the airport, and we got the little one with us. Yes, are you gonna go to snow? She gets to stay with you, yeah? What do you mean? She doesn't get stuck in the belly of the plane or No, anything. she goes, we have a little thing that she goes under the seat in front of us because she's small enough. Good. Wow. Yeah! <laughs> We're just, we got to the airport. Oh, this is dirty. I should be doing this on my camera. We got to the airport pretty early. I don't like being stressed for time anymore. So we got here. There are so many people coughing, um, but we're here early just waiting for a flight. Everything's going smoothly, knock on wood. There's no wood around here. I got this. Bamboo cows. This dog loves traveling. Yes, I'm cute. Show me what you just found. She found a bird in the airport. I saw it and said, pick it up. <laughs> we don't know what to do with it, but it was about to get run over because it's not doing well and it was sitting in the middle of the walkway and people were definitely about to tramps over it. So we're trying to make our way to our gate because we don't like, we have a little layover, but we're trying to figure out what to do with the bird. And there isn't like people who work here. <laughs> Babe, you can't. But bring it <laughs> Through much convincing, she handed it over to uh, a cop. So there was a police officer just standing there. He looked nice. We gave it to him. He took it. He's like, oh, I'll take it downstairs. Because it happens. And he thanked us and he went downstairs with it. We don't know what downstairs is. It could be a place where they kill birds. But he seemed pretty genuine. Yeah, he was nice. She wasn't 
wouldn't let me take it on a plane with us. I, I, she, I think that's ridiculous. She legit wanted to take it. No. I you said, you don't know who you're with. You're I, and then I said, you're okay. You're the wrong person. I said, just so you know, do what you want. But it would make me uncomfortable if you brought it on the plane. So she gave it up. But uh, we have a, I think that's we're- true love there, folks. <laughs> well, what you did? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, we have about a 20 minute uh, hangout till we get on a three hour flight and then we can oh, have a two hour drive. Let's go. Merry Christmas. All right, you saw snow. We just got to her parents' house. Oh, it's so cozy. I have never had a white Christmas. I've mentioned this before, and this is as close as I'm gonna get. I mean, I'm leaving before Christmas, but it's fun to be like, oh, this is what the movies show. There's snow and Christmas lights with the snow. When her parents visited, they were laughing. They're like, it's so weird to see Christmas lights and no snow. I was like, we're trying. Anyway, I'm gonna pack a little bit, maybe shower. I do not want to. That sounds terrible. But I have not washed my hair in four days. I need it. Okay. I'm so exhausted. <laughs> I didn't shower. I didn't do it. After that, we went upstairs. I ate about half a can of Pringles and then went to bed. And it was fantastic and glorious. I probably should have showered though because when I itched my back this morning, there were definitely pimples. I get back knee and if I don't stick to a strict regimen with it, I break out. It's not cute. You know, God couldn't make me absolutely perfect. I had to come with some flaws. If you wanted to know what they are, I'm very aware of them. I sleep with my mouth open. I look like a mummy. I have back knee. I'm prone to hemorrhoids. <sighs> I have a weird gap between my big toe and my, my, the one next to it. Yeah, that's basically it. I'm aware of them though. I've come to terms with them. Like it's not too stressful and like they humble me. I have, I have to be humbled somehow. And like, it's not enough to take away any confidence or to shrink my ego or make my head any smaller. It's just, you know, something to be like, Hey, reminder, you aren't absolutely perfect and that's okay. <laughs> anyway. Oh, uh, I love you guys. Oh, I wanted to tell you. So, the bird, we're pretty sure it's safe. I wanted to film more, but we were literally rushing. This is the thing with traveling. When traveling it is so hard to vlog because I don't do it where I have massive layovers in between my flights. I'm like, hour, hour layover, point A, point B. I don't have time to take out my camera and film everything. And we're rushing in the airport. And then also we're on the plane, it's too loud to film anything. And so when you're traveling all day, there's not much to film, but I really wanted to film the bird thing. Cause like straight up, we're walking down and this dude with the, one of those wheelchairs, you know, the assistant people that help people on and off the, or like through the next gate or whatever. He almost runs over this bird and goes, oh, and then goes around it. I was like, I looked at it, I was like, Abby, there's a bird, grab it. Abby loves grabbing animals. So she grabs it and it like, it just went, eh. And she went, no, I just picked it up. So clearly it was struggling because it just let her pick it up. And then she was just holding it and I'm carrying the dog, all of her luggage now as well and mine because she's holding a bird. So I've got everything and I'm like trying to get a camera out so I can film it. We had no time to like stop and think because we just had to get to our next gate because we're in the Denver airport and it's huge and we were in Terminal A and we had to be at B and then we had to take a train. Anyway, it was a lot. So as we got to our gate, I was like, babe, please. <laughs> We saw a cop, I was like, just give it to him. Give, give him a job to do today. And so she did, um, but yeah. We're here, we're safe, we're sound, and vlogging should be easy from here on out. I love you guys and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye!